Three Evils of Capitalism by Eric Schechter The three most conspicuous consequences of capitalism are poverty, war, and ecocide. Poverty could be eliminated if we would only learn to share, as did the early followers of Jesus in the Book of Acts. War is mass murder based on lies, making politicians rich. Ecocide means killing everything. It's accelerating because corporations lobby effectively against any laws that would cut into their short-term profits. Ironically, they'll have no profits at all after the planet is dead. Ecocide has become worse in recent years, but all three of these conspicuous evils have tormented us since the invention of property 10,000 years ago. They come to us through three subtler evils, inequality, externalities, and alienation. Inequality. If we don't share, we trade. But that gives greater benefit to the trader who was in the stronger bargaining position, thus making him stronger still. So trade concentrates wealth into few hands. And wealth is power. And the Stanford Prison Experiment proved that power corrupts, making all evils possible. Externalities. A trade negotiated between buyer and seller can affect a third party in harmful ways. These externalized costs include poverty, war, and ecocide. Alienation. The market makes us all into meaningless commodities to be exploited or discarded. We can't care about others while competing against them. Thus, each one of us is alone. That anguish makes all evils possible. In conclusion, private property is killing us. We need to figure out how to share. The first step is to get more people talking about it. Read more at leftymathprof.org.